Janessa's here and we're about to film a video. My room's a mess. We're about to film a get ready with me, but the process to get all my shit upstairs is insane. Like we are gonna do like a PR package opening thing, like opening up new products because she got some stuff in the mail as well from Morphe. So this is all of our shit here. <laughs> well let's just like let's you know let's just bring Yeah, this whole we're basket. just gonna bring the whole basket. <laughs> What's up? Oh my teeth are lighter. Oh, do you hear that? No. You hear it? Welcome back to my channel. <laughs> Three hours later. I found it. <laughs> so we're doing our makeup today. Just gonna do some quick uh, unboxing of some of the stuff that we both got in the mail recently. Um, she went off. She went off with Morphe today. That Morphe sale though? Uh, yeah, and this box. To. This is all the PR stuff that I've been wanting to unbox so you guys can... Janessa and I are gonna show you guys what I got and yeah. show you guys what she got too. It's not like a major unboxing, <laughs> but go eat major. Yeah, so we're just gonna get ready while trying new products. Um, not going anywhere special. We're just both going to dance practice. Okay, this is the third soul body um, thing I got. So, not in this box, but the other box came with glowing oil. Two glowing oils, and I already have three and with then... a kabuki brush. And they just sent these today. Um, gradual sunless tanning lotion. Never tried. Someone tell me, are these good? Because... I'm not really a tanning person. I'll try it, and then if I don't yeah. like it, you can have it. Well, you also got two shades. You got, like, light to medium and, and medium. And fair to light. Oh, okay. Yeah. Or medium so, to dark. Medium to dark. This is from Good Molecules. Never heard of them, but they were wanting to send me stuff, which is great. So gave me a brightening toner. Um, an overnight exfoliating treatment. Amazing. Amazing. I'm so hungry. And then a hyaluronic acid serum and a squalane oil. Okay. And then we got another Cotter Pop one. Oh, excited to try this. I'm going to try some of this today. I saw so many videos on this yeah, one. Yeah, same. So they sent three colors of their pretty fresh tinted moisturizer. Amazing. And then they sent... Uh, okay, I'm intrigued. I want to open this. Yeah. I haven't opened it. This is a pretty fresh setting mist. Oh! Look at that packaging! That's so cute! That's cute. You know what it reminds me of though? Kylie skin. Yeah, literally. Right? It yeah. looks like Kylie skin. Mm -hmm. And then they sent a... This looks so cool. A primer. A primer? primer? Lightweight hydrating primer that refreshes and puffs skin for makeup application. Interesting. Ooh. Oh, you... Ooh! That's a primer? Mm-hmm. Mm. This is cute. Wow, that is pretty packaging. That's it's nice. all like matte based. Packaging, which is great. This one is more of like a refill thing, I guess. But I got the whatever palette. First of all, this packaging. It's so cute. It's so Mean Girls vibes, whatever. It's called the whatever palette. But this is everything. Amazing. That gold. Yeah. That gonna, gold glitter. Are you going to use it? Oh. oh, you have your own palettes right now. Hang on oh, a sec. Let's get on. to that. Anyways, after that, I got two of uh, really nice nude lip colors because that's all I wear. And then the no filter concealer because I wanted a refill of that and a contour stick. How do you like the no filter concealer? It's actually so good. Really? Yeah, it's actually really good. Color pop. Oh, that one was like in the video that you and I filmed last time, but okay, I didn't I get so. around to like showing anyone that in any of my videos. So okay. I was kind of hoping to just release because we got show everyone got a birthday cake yeah they did like a halo top and color pop um collab and they sent me a bunch of the eyeshadows and they sent me a bunch of other stuff okay so i'm a huge jacqueline hill fan she was one of the first youtubers that i've ever watched same um, she's so pretty she's gorgeous and she like i thought she was so credible and i still think she is mm -hmm. but i bought or like I got the Jaclyn Hill original palette when it first came out, obviously, so I brought that. How much did you use of this already? Oh, like... Oh, wow! I hit pan on two colors. Oh my gosh, yeah, but those are like transition colors. Exactly. Like, 
Oh, this palette's everything. So I know, cool. like the color, every the like of it is like amazing. Everyone knows about <gasps> it. Can I use it for my crease? Yes. A okay. higher percent. We're gonna be sharing everything today. And then, obviously, after her original palette, she dropped the vault collection. So she got the whole thing. She she got money. Yeah. You got the money. He got money. Get it all for him. So all the shadows that she made with Morphe while creating the original palette, there's obviously shadows that like you won't be using or like putting into that palette. So mm -hmm. she took all those other shadows that she loved so much and made it into a four palette vault collection. So it was hiding. It was in hiding. It yeah. wasn't ready yet. I had to open one of them just to like look at them. Yeah. She was like, I want to open them. I said, no, <laughs> wait for the video. We can open one. Yeah. And so they're called, when, there's four of them. There's Dark Magic, Armed and Gorgeous, Bling Boss. I thought I was going to say Bling Bloss. Bling Bloss. <laughs> bling Bloss. And then Ring the Alarm. Ring the Alarm. Ring the Alarm. I'm a little too low, but I'll be back to see another chicken, y'all. Yeah, Beyonce. Beyonce vibes, you know. Honestly. Ring the Alarm. I opened it. Sorry. But. Oh, it's so pretty. I like this color right here. Yes. This is so fall. Right? Right here. This is fall right there for you guys. Let's this is like, they're fresh. Off. They're fresh out of the womb. I have armed and gorgeous. Oh my gosh, I was trying to open it when you could just... <gasps> wow! Wow, that's very fall, actually. Mm -hmm. Armed and gorgeous. Holy F! Janessa. Okay, and this one is Bling Boss. Ready? Five, six, seven, seven eight. eight. Dancer things. Ooh! Wow! Oh my gosh. Oh! So pretty. Last but not least. Not the least. Dark magic. Ooh, yes. Wait, didn't we look at this? Nope. Amazing. Wow. She's Armed killing it, man. No, dark magic. Dark magic. I love it. Yes. It's good. That's so nice. All of these colors were all the ones that didn't make into the original, so they made four other ones. I still don't try any of the other stuff I have. I know. You don't need to buy anything. It's okay. We, we have we share for life. And we have we share. Technically. But anyways, there's the unboxing of our stuff. So um, exciting. I say our stuff because she literally will come over and just try it off. So <laughs> Literally. Even better. <laughs> but we're going to get started on the makeup. So this is uh, pretty fresh. Ew. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Um, I'm using the Cover FX Gripping Primer. Mm. I just wanted to try it out. I know it's not the best for dry skin because it oh. normally will dry you out. It does not smell good. I know, it smells good. Oh. Mm. Mm. Okay, it smells like skincare. It does. So it looks like this. Oh my gosh, it smells so good. Oh my god. It smells like summer. Yeah, it does. Anyway, it's gripping since we're dancing later. Gripping your thighs. And the texture of it. It's so... Whoa! It like feels like glue. Yeah. I'm using like a pea size amount. Okay. Oh, we'll yeah, it's that. like so... so wow! Different. Wow. Right? Yeah, so I'm putting it on the areas that I do crease, which is like the smile lines. The and nose is okay. I find that it's so sticky. It's so tacky. Now I'm gonna go straight into the eyebrows, my usual routine. Because there's not that much to fill anymore, I just have to clean a little bit and fill like the ends. I'm gonna go in and just do the usual. We both woke up at like 1 p.m. Yikes. Well, I actually woke up at like 7. Went home, I went to, I tried to sleep, but I couldn't because like my head was hurting so much from washing. Washing my hair at night and going straight to bed. Any Filipinos, if your mom's told you not to go to sleep with your hair wet, trust her. Because I didn't listen to my mom and I took a shower last night and slept with my hair wet and I woke up with the worst migraine. The worst. Um, I am going in straight into my brows with none other elf pencil. Mm -hmm. Elf brow pencil. It's the best thing ever. It is. I really want to try the so new good. one. The precise brow pencil from Elf. Um, Roxette, Arissa, and Yes, Polito always use it. I'm going to go straight to foundation. That looks really good. Wow, I'm so freaking white. Well, no shade. <laughs> We're wearing the colors that we are right now. 
<laughs> Literally. Brown and white. I'm just transparent, right? Okay, I'm just going, going. Good. <laughs> Cause we're dancing today and I have like a freaking six hour practice. Is it me? Yeah, my usual. Usual matte and poreless. I've been using a darker shade um, cause my mom jacked mine. I saw it in the bathroom. I was like, this is where it effing went. My foundation really. <laughs> It's all good though. This one works. I'm just cleaning out my brows, finishing them off, and I'm taking the L'Oreal Infallible for full, 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 full layer. Um, apparently, this has been named like the Shape Tape Dupe. Since I was using the Infallible concealer, I'm gonna use the Infallible foundation. foundation. I said I always Understand. use this just for my eyebrows, but I wanna use it today. Anyways, what I did was I took my ColourPop concealer and I just put that, you guys can see, it was like just down here and then I just spread it. I feel like adding another hat, like concealer that's way lighter just in the area here, this automatically brightens it up because she's tired today. I'm gonna check out that cream contour from ColourPop, the No Filter Stick. It's actually a foundation, but I got a darker one. Um, just to try it as a cream contour because I've been using a foundation as cream contour and it's a little harsh mm. But this color is decent. It's in the color dark 165 Ooh, neutral. That literally looks like a dupe for that super stay. Oh interesting. Oh shit. Oh Oh, well, my I guess mine's more like warm. Yeah, mine's more cool because I need a cool because she's cool Because <clears throat> she more fucking cool. She more fucking cool so I'm just putting that on the areas that I would normally bronze very lightly. I'll go in later with them. Okay, I'm definitely went in heavy with my foundation too. Oh, I'm glad this is not as dark as like the foundation I use. She's full coverage. She's full coverage. Wow, this is so creamy. It's so good. I'm gonna blend those areas out. Me, on the other hand, I've been like, so into the cream stuff. Me too. It just stays on nicer. It looks more natural. Yeah. And I do still use like powder on top of it, but it's not as harsh. And when she wants to try, wow, this blends so nicely. What the f? So wow, this is exactly what I needed. So does the super stay. Really? Yeah, actually. And lately I've been like making my nose look really slim and the way I highlight my nose too is really different now. I use like a tiny ass brush. Oh, to like really get in there? Yeah. I'm taking a super stay. Maybelline multi-use foundation stick in the color 330 Caramel. My like, face feels very hydrated. I go like super duper light. I like even just do that. Oh, I like. I'm going in with one of my blush sticks from ColourPop that I use. Yeah, there we go. I'm gonna use the color under pressure, it's a cream under blush. Pressure. And I'm just gonna use like a fluffy brush. I did not clean my brushes, but you know, whatever. Honestly. You got me tripping. So I just added some of that blush, just for color, a little bit. Okay, and then I'm gonna go in with a cream highlighter as well. We're going cream, we're going full out cream, and then a little bit of powder. Except I'm need bad eyes. I'm going with the color Bullseye by ColourPop, which is the highlighting blush stick with a stippling brush. And I'm gonna like just stipple that on the high points where I usually put highlight. You're literally so fast at doing your face. Oh, I like practice. I'm gonna go in now with um, a, that small brush with the note for the nose contour. I'm gonna put this just at the tip of the nose. I heard you loving on you. I come like a thief in a Using the Cody Airspun concealer, I mean powder. Can I use that after? Yeah, of course. And I'm gonna set 
underneath my eyes, on top of my eyes. Then I'm gonna pull up on you. I pull up, I pull up on you. You know when I'm coming through. So I clearly like overlined my nose, so I'm going back in with my conceal or like whatever was on my sponge and just like moving that around. That's all. I'm gonna go in with a blush now. Still going with the the peachy tone that we decided. And I'm going in with the wet and wild keep it peachy. Okay. I've never ever used this. Really? Yeah. You've never tried it. No. So baking just doesn't do well with me. I use a pixie highlight um, to set on top of the highlight. And then she finished with some Cody Airspun as well. Now I'm gonna go straight to the eyes. And I'm gonna go straight in with the whatever palette. Ooh, should I go pe Oh yeah. Okay, I'm just gonna go in Bobbi Brown just to set on top of the eyes. Mm -hmm. the dark eyeshadow. So hopefully the stippling brush doesn't have any. I didn't clean any of my brushes. Same. <laughs> Like, I can't tell if this brush has a product on it. I'm gonna go in with the color Copycat. I'll just pop a picture of it right here um, in the Ding. whatever palette. Ding! With a fluffy brush, the M505 by Morphe. And I'm just gonna focus that on my crease. I'm taking a stippling brush and going in with this cream contour that she just used. Because I wanna see how it is. You mean cream blush? Oh, yep, that's what I said <laughs> contour. Okay, so I just put that in the crease. I'm gonna go in with a a still brush as well, an eyeshadow brush. So we're using Pass It On. I'm just gonna focus that on the outer corner. Okay, I took my sponge because I felt like the brush wasn't really doing much, and I thought it was a little too concentrated. So oh, that looks really nice. Wait, that looks so like. Natural. Wow, that looks so nice on you. I need to try that with Beauty Blender. What the frick? Thanks. Thanks. But yeah, like I felt like the brush was making it too concentrated into one spot. It wasn't really moving it, so I took the sponge. And like, since it's pretty pigmented. Wait, where's the color? Oh, there it is. So I just focus this on the outer corner. You guys can really see. But do the highlight. Yeah, that highlight though. Highlight, yeah. Okay, outer corner. I'm kind of bringing that inwards, like with no extra product. We're just going to the middle. I'm gonna go in with a more dense brush. Um, it's like super domey. It's like M169 by Morphe. It's like a cute little dome brush. Bad guy. And this, I'm literally just adding this on the outer third of the eye. Oh, this is a nice color, Janessa. So is this. That? Yeah. Like, right? wow. Is that the one I used? Yeah. That's so pretty. Right? Oh, I, should, I wish I kind of did like a smoke. Okay, we're good. <laughs> are, you, are you good? You have to use like a really light feathery <gasps> brush for that. Okay, I'm doing it. Going in with that same brush with past copycat. And I'm just gonna diffuse the outer corner, that way it's not so harsh. And then we're gonna go straight in with a concealer in the beginning. All right, same concealer. Concealer and concealer brush I used earlier. I'm gonna cut the beginning of the eyes. I'm gonna cut them off. So. Same thing. I kind of like to just go downwards. That way I'm not super uneven. And rather than swiping motions, I just tap the concealer on. Whenever you think you added too much product, take your beauty blender or sponge. Literally go over top of it. it diffuses so much color. So I'm bringing that concealer in like two thirds of the eye. Nowhere near the dark shade. And then I'm gonna go in with another fluffy brush 
with the color pass it on and I'm gonna gradually add this. Oh no, no, pass it on. I'll go with maybe later. I'm just gonna put this right in the beginning of the eye here, or not beginning, right at the edge of the concealer and just blend that out. And then I'm gonna go in with a flat shader brush. I went in with the color, duh, because Janessa suggested it and it's like hella glitter, but I love it. I'm taking my Jack Wendell palettes. See what I can do. Think but Ooh, I forgot to actually bronze. Whoopsies. Maybe that's why. Yeah. I just feel like, like something, something's missing. Yeah. And like something was <laughs> she was like, I have better days. <laughs> I feel like I have had better makeup days. No, your makeup looks good. I'm gonna go in with a concealer brush. I'm and using I'm the City Bronzer. The best. Maybelline, just like sponsor me. Do what I wanna do? eyeliner it, Janessa? I have this love-hate relationship with eyeliner right now. I know. It's just... Uh, so your opinion's biased right now. Yeah, like, I would say no. And smoke out your bottom and just have your lash. But at the same time, like, I liner would make it look really nice, too. Should That's I try everything. something with this? Yeah, try it. I'm scared. What am I gonna do? Just be careful, you know? <laughs> Just every single time. I don't know what to do. I'm gonna go in with review swashes by Alexander August, as usual. I was saying, I want to be natural today. Yeah, that's apparently not happening. I don't know which one. This one. This one? Yeah. I think I'm gonna put on eyeliner today. We're just gonna go for the full shablam. Shablam. <laughs> We're gonna shablam it. <laughs> full shablam. I'm going in with the eyeliner brush by Sigma. It's a small angle brush. And I'm gonna do a wing. Oh my gosh. Okay, so I swatched some of these colors and they're gorgeous. Like that, oh, that green. What do I do with this first? I'm dipping into Agent, this little guy. It's definitely like an orange, like burnt orange. I just did that one color and I started with the transition. And I did it all, I started in like the outer corner into my crease and then I, then I really brought the color in. I pray for me everybody because I'm going into top secret, which is this olive, olive color. Okay, we're done. Done the eyes, there we go. We got some lashes on. You were so fast. Yeah, I work pretty fast now. I like to take my time. Not anymore, but you also are playing with new shadows. And I'm like, the whatever palette is very neutral, so it's easy to work with, I think. I'm doing something completely different than what I normally would do. It's because you're with me. I know. Okay, it's gonna take a while, everybody. <laughs> I got this. Yo! It's coming together. Oh, it's coming together. It's dark, but. No, it's coming together. Oh, I can't wait to see. <coughs> Excuse me. Okay. I choked. I'm going in with the color Sunny Side by ColourPop. Oh my god. Okay, so Mark is in the Philippines. Mm -hmm. And he is spending a lot of time with his family and like both his Lolas. Aww. And I know, so cute. I met one of them already. Oh, you did? Before cute. she went back to the Philippines. That's cute. You no, know, every like Lola's house is like haunted. Hell. So he's like freaking out. I don't know what I'm doing. I'm scared to sleep. I fucks with this color. It's Tina. It's a Tina look. Oh, it's, 100%. It's the usual Tina look. I'm done. So we're just chilling. Gonna watch Janessa finish her makeup. Let's just bring you guys in. Three hours later. Three hours later. Oh, I'll show you guys mine. But like, Three this is a finished later. look. The lashes are looking kind of ratch at the top, so let's just not go there. I'll just kind of like... But this is a lip, really nice. Eyeshadow. Okay, now that I'm looking at the camera, I'm like, let's fix these brows. <laughs> okay, so this side is darker than the other. So let's try an equal and even that out. I'm going to blend it out yet again. So I'm just using circular motions, going into my crease, going back on the outer. And just matching it. <laughs> All right, she's going in with the color coin. Let's see what happens. Let me 
Oh my god, Tina. Oh my gosh, that's insanely nice. Wow! Okay, I'm gonna take top secret again, like hella lightly. We like did a full unboxing video of all my PR stuff. Kitchen. Right here in the kitchen. Like, look. All of my shit. Oh my god. Right? Right? She's did you going do that? somewhere. Yeah. yeah. I'm kind of oh like gosh. teaching her with it. Say hi to the camera. No. <laughs> Come on, just say hi. Bye. You look cute. Hey, this is Mila. <laughs> okay, so Janessa added the crease color on her bottom lash line and deepened it with the olive green. And now let's, she's and just now, doing last minute touch ups of the colors. Which one should I use? How is um? Use both. Yes, contour, blush on. Blush on. I was looking for my foundation, like my regular shade, and I saw it in the bathroom with her stuff. <laughs> hey, I saw it in the garbage. Garbage? What? Yes. Why would I put it in the garbage? Yeah, those two, those two bottles. Yeah. Uh-uh, I did not, I would never throw that in the garbage, Mom. Huh, you did. You just did. <laughs> no, I didn't. It's in the washroom. So I could take it back. Just kidding. <laughs> so I can have it back. So I can have it back. Does this fit anyone's finger? Why doesn't fit me? Oh, I need lashes. Let's see how this is forgetting. I'm excited. Oops, just kidding. Oh my god. <laughs> Look at her lashes. Yeah, they're so They're long. so like curvy. I see a curvy girl. Because she's white. <laughs> yeah. Not all white people have this. Most, Most of my white friends do. Really? Like, all the girls at Earl's have nice lashes. Are we finito? Not quite. Three hours Look later. at that. Like one eye compared to the other. much for watching that's our get ready with me you know there's a little more like in depth with uh janessa but you know what she learned something new mm -hmm. and this look wow wow hi michaela <laughs> looks really good <laughs> but yeah this is us getting ready to go to practice literally <laughs> amazing they would just sweat but they have to wear makeup you know what <laughs> mom it doesn't come off but thanks for off. watching thanks. Uh, follow her on Instagram and on she doesn't have a YouTube, but she posts stuff on Instagram Although also, actually I do have a YouTube You have a YouTube? I didn't know that. I had to because um, I had to Post my like demo reel and all that stuff oh, so I had to make We're gonna YouTube. stalk her You can follow me on all social platforms at Janessa Tool. Hey, and Michaela And Michaela. Hey. Michaela Mendez. I'm gonna put their stuff on my link below. But thanks for watching guys. Thanks. That was fun. Oh, oh, oh.